Hi, I'm Debbie from Living Energy Farm, and I'm going to show you some of the ways that we use solar energy uh, to achieve food self-sufficiency on our farm. We are off the grid. We grow most of the food that we eat, and we process it using solar power. So these are some of the things that we use our grinder for. This is a, a grain maker. Um, it's hooked up by a belt to a DC motor. I'm going to show you how it runs in a minute. Um, some of the things that we grow on our farm, we grow corn. This is a, a drying col corn called Tennessee Red Cob Heirloom Dent Corn. I'm going to show you how to grind that up for cornmeal. Um, we also grow wheat. Um, these are some of the things that we've ground, ground up with our, our grinder here. This is um, wheat that we've made into flour. We also grow peanuts. Um, this is Carwiles Virginia is the variety that we grow on our farm and we roast it and grind it up for peanut butter. And then, oh, hey Rosa, you wanna let smoke in? <laughs> and then right now we're gonna grind up corn to make cornmeal, which we're gonna make into cornbread later on. All right, so this, um, this grain maker has two different augers. So the larger one is the one we're gonna use for corn. So we put that in there. For cornmeal, we usually do two passes. The first time through is pretty coarse, and then the second time through, we tighten it down a lot to get it real fine. So we're putting the plate on, tighten it down. Do you want to get in and look in the hopper here? I'm going to put corn in the hopper. So you can see on here it says one direction for coarse and the other direction for fine. So we're going to adjust that once it gets going. So now, over on this side we've got a pretty heavy duty switch that's rated for DC. Um, and we've got a power cord going out to our solar panels. And the power cord goes right to, if you want to look under here, uh, there's a DC motor right there. I don't know, baby, we're doing video right now. I think he's in the shop, maybe? Yeah, I think so. So this DC motor is going to start turning. I'll show you for a second. So you can see that DC motor turning. It's turning a belt, which is turning the grinder. So we don't have to do it by hand, which is great. <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to adjust it to get the coarseness that I want. Set that out a little coarser. All right. So when we do cornmeal, the first time through we do it pretty coarse just to kind of crack the kernels. And then we're going to send it through a second time. One of the tricks for this grinder is that if you do it too, too fine the first time through, it's going to want to clog up. So we keep it pretty coarse the first time through. That's just about right. So we'll come back later when we make it into cornmeal and I'll show you the next step. <laughs> All right, we're back with our grinder making cornmeal. We're gonna run it a second time through. So we're gonna take our coarse ground and put it back in the hopper. And then we're gonna tighten down our adjustment here and turn it on. Run it a little bit, turn it down. Doing that for a while until we get it as fine as we want it for baking. It's almost there. <laughs> Oh, I didn't like that. Back out. Watching it. Come on. All right. So that's just about right. Maybe we'll take down the and feed rate a little bit. There's an adjustment here so you can slow down how much it's feeding in case you're stressing the motor a little bit. So 
that's about right. So we're gonna run this for a while and make it into cornmeal, and then we're gonna make that into cornbread. Oh. There it goes. 